Well, the UK government is investing heavily in green infrastructure in a bid to encourage people to ditch their motor vehicles to reduce carbon emissions. As a result, some businesses are now turning to pedal power in order to get the job done. Oliver Regan reports. Is this the future for city delivery services? Cargo bike sales are accelerating in the UK, with the Bicycle Association of Great Britain predicting a 60% increase in the year ahead. Shrewsbury-based Keith Jepson was an early convert, setting up an e-cargo bike delivery service for local businesses in 2019, and it's proving very popular. We've done a lot of B2B deliveries, um, but also we're, we've started to see kind of more B2C stuff as well. So we're going uh, delivering stuff straight to the kind of customer. It's practical, it's fun, they kind of bought into the cool message of it. So for the independents, the coffee houses, the artisan bakery and, and lots of the independent stores around town, they really like the message it's, it's, it's giving and uh, they like to see their brand being seen to be using it around the city. Many cities and towns in the UK suffer from chronically congested road networks and the increasing demand for home deliveries has meant more vehicles on the road but at a relatively low cost of between two and six thousand dollars e-cargo bikes are an economical and flexible alternative you'll be amazed what we can carry we've carried everything from a small boat to golf clubs to flowers and really delicate items so it's really very practical solution the UK government is planning to invest almost $500 million in green infrastructure, including building new cycle lanes in a bid to become carbon neutral by 2050. So will sites like this now become a common feature on the country's roads? Rally certainly thinks so. The popular British brand predicts the sale of cargo bikes will dramatically increase, from just a few hundred units sold in 2020 to 10 times that in the next five years. The market's so broad, you've got perhaps a small business owner that might use it for the school run and their work purposes. Um, you've got the growth in last mile deliveries. The market's in its infancy. Um, as the market grows and develops, we get a better understanding of what the products need to be and, and the tasks that they need to do. And so naturally, you'll see an, an evolution of the product. Compared to its European neighbours, the UK's e-cargo bike market is still tiny. Germany, for example, sold 20 times more bikes than the UK did last year. But with a government grant system providing funding for up to 40% of the cost of a new bike for businesses willing to switch from four wheels to two, expected to start catching up soon. Oliver Regan, TRT World, Shrewsbury, UK.